We're breaking down what that massive infrastructure package could mean for New Mexico and just how many jobs could be coming along with those improvements to roads, broadband access, and more. Today we spoke with Congresswoman Melanie Stansberry, who voted in support of the bill. Take a look. The $1.2 trillion infrastructure bill still awaiting the president's sign-off. Finally, Infrastructure Week. Could reportedly bring $3.7 billion in funding to New Mexico. Investing in our communities. Representative Melanie Stansberry, who voted for the Infrastructure Investments and Jobs Act, says about $2.5 billion would improve New Mexico roads, plus $225 million for bridge replacement and repairs. More than $350 million is slated for safe drinking water infrastructure in areas that have seen underinvestment for decades. Which is so crucial for so many of our communities, especially our rural and tribal communities. Plus, more for public transportation, airport improvements, and expanding broadband access. The Congresswoman adds that this could create thousands of jobs for New Mexicans in all sectors. Whether that's putting broadband into the ground and connecting our households, whether that's building roads and repairing bridges across the state, it's working on clean energy infrastructure and in our grid, or it's working on pipelines and water infrastructure. In a tweet, Republican Congresswoman Yvette Harrell, representing southern New Mexico, is lashing out against Democrats. She says the massive spending bill heaps crippling debt on future generations of Americans. President Biden says he will wait to sign the infrastructure bill until lawmakers return from recess.